now let's see how to examine an obstetric patient. Uh, the first thing is the position. Ensure that the patient is lying in supine position with her knees slightly bent if necessary. And then expose her from the ziphy sternum to the pubic symphysis. And ensure that your hands are clean and warm. The first thing we have to do is to measure the symphysiofundal height. So for this we need to feel the uterine fundus. So to feel the uterine fundus, you use the ulnar surface of your palm and start from the ziphy sternum and slowly work your way down and stop when your hand meets the first point of resistance. Okay, okay so that is going to be your fundus. Now use your tape measure. Uh, keep the centimeter side away from you and this is just to avoid bias. And now feel the pubic symphysis. You may have to warn the mother at this point because it may be a bit uncomfortable when you press on the pubic symphysis. Okay, and you can measure right up to the pubic symphysis and flip your tape. So that shows 36 centimeters, isn't it? That's we right. know that this lady is 36 weeks. Mm. So this corresponds to her gestation. Now let's move on to the Leopold's maneuvers. Okay. So let's do the first maneuver. So the first maneuver is used to find out what is presenting in the fundal region. So use the palm of both your hands and feel. So what are you feeling now? I feel a smooth, firm surface. Mm -hmm. This moves with the rest of the fetal body. So this slightly corresponds to the baby's bump. Yeah, okay. Now let's do the second maneuver. So use one hand to stabilize the uterus and your, with the other hand, you have to feel from the top right down to pubic symphysis. So what do you think you're feeling there? I feel multiple small and hard knobbly parts. Mm -hmm. This could likely uh, correspond to the fetal limbs. Okay. Now stabilize that hand and use your other hand and then feel. Again, in, from the top to the bottom. So what do you think you're feeling now? I feel a smooth, continuous surface mm -hmm. and this would likely correspond to the fetal back. Okay. So now let's go on to the third one. So for the third manoeuvre, you have to open your hand as wide as you can and just above the pubic symphysis, gently grab and gently rock. You may have to warn the mother again that this can be painful. Okay. Okay, so what do you feel now? I now feel a smooth but hard surface. Mm -hmm. This is likely to be the fetal head. Okay, so this makes sense because we felt the baby's bottom right. at the top, so you would expect to feel the baby's head uh, mm -hmm. as a presenting part. Yes. Okay, now let's move on to the fourth manoeuvre. So for this one, you have to turn the other way around and face the patient's feet and use both your hands and just feel just above the pubic symphysis. You may have to yeah, bend your elbow, otherwise you may just irritate the rectal muscle if you palpate straight away mm -hmm. and it will go into spasm and it's difficult to feel what's underneath it. So what do you feel now? My fingers are unable to meet each other below mm -hmm. the presenting part. However, I can feel most of the fetal head, so this is likely to be four feet palpable. Yeah. And it also confirms that it is a head when you feel it. Right. So your fourth maneuver confirms what you have seen in the third maneuver. Mm -hmm. And it also helps us to work out how far the baby's head has gone into the pelvis. And when your hands meet underneath the presenting part, it's five feet palpable. Mm -hmm. Then as you said, when you feel most of the presenting part, but your hands still, they're not meeting down, then it's four fifths palpable. So if it's three fifths palpable, you will feel equal amount of head on both sides. And if you don't feel anything at all, it is zero fifths palpable. But if you feel head on one side and not on the other side, it's one fifths palpable. Okay. Now let's move on to uh, auscultating the fetal heart. So given that the fetus is in a catholic presentation mm -hmm. and the fetal back is on the maternal right, yeah. I will actually listen to the fetal heart mm -hmm. or locate it using the top tone. Mm -hmm the maternal right and below the umbilicus. Yes. So the fetal heart rate is around 150 beats per minute. Okay. So how would you like to summarize your findings? So in summary, my obstetric examination reviews a longitudinally distended gravid uterus mm -hmm. and the symphysial fundal height is about 36 cm which corresponds to the fetal gestation. The fetus is in a longitudinal line and a catholic presentation and the head is about 4 fifths palpable. The fetal heart rate can be picked up at about 150 beats per minute. Yeah. Okay. So this is how you would summarize an obstetric examination.